Or is my freedom your wish? Uh, what is that? Like, they look like proper infested testicles with spikes on them. Hey everyone, my name is Mike, and in this video we'll be continuing the main story quest, Ladies of the Wood. And the actual quest is we're looking for the Elderman of Down Warren. Um, the, the three witches called the Crones have given us this quest where, you know, there's a problem within the village that needs fixing. I think we've got to kill something. I'm a little bit, my memory's done a brain fart on me. Anyway, we'll, we'll get to this guy anyway, the Elderman, and hopefully he'll update us and recap us on what's going on. Alright guys, we're now approaching the um, the village where the Elderman is going to be. Down Warren is the name of the village. So, it should be one of these guys here, this guy here in the green coat. Greetings. And um, what's bothering the villagers? Nice village. Boy, a real pearl of the swamps. If you say so. You get by alright? Boy, winter to winter. Somehow we survive. Recognize this dagger? So the witches give us this dagger as well. Aye, master. I didn't know you belonged to them. I'm glad we understand each other. I don't belong to anyone. Let's just go with that one. So you know who sent me. Good. Easier that way. Forgive me. I didn't know you came from the ladies of the wood. They help you often? From the time of his cutting, every man is theirs. They be harsh mistresses, but they're fair. Just. Demanding they can be, but then nothing in life comes easy. Who drove off the plaguey heirs? Who gave us seeds to plant? Round the other villages, they be eating the soles of their boots, whereas we, well, we get along well enough. So, let's get to the problem. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power, an evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the whispering hillock they lie. Unburied all fathers, sons, daughters and mothers. Folk are afeared to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. All right then, should be easy enough. Ladies of the wood don't know what this power is. They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they, for they sent you. I'll look around the whispering hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. Don't ye treat this evil light. All right, so find out what's killing the villagers from Down Warren. Let's get on our horsey. Here, Roach. Come on, Roach. Let's go. Be gone. Come no closer. I know whence you come. What was that? Alright, so we know there's some kind of beast or like spirit or something. Whoa there. That's the uh, that protect me. They sense whence you come. What the hell's going on? Find a passage leading under the hill using a witcher sensors. I think that's the passage there, isn't it? It kind of looks like... Oh no, that's a wall. Never mind. <laughs> I thought that was a cave. Anyway, we got to get Boys. under the hill. The so... Oh, we've got some wolves. Okay, so we need to get underneath this, this hill. With the tree is. We need to look around. It says use your witcher. Okay, we can't really use the witcher sensors because we're in combat. So let's get these wolves killed first. And oh, we can see on the map now, it, there's a marker over here showing where the cave entrance is. So, um, oh, it's a, it's a place of power down there as well. So we'll be able to get an attribute point. That's quite lucky. So let's make our way down to the other side. Why can't he jump over those rocks? What the hell? Alright, here we go. Be gone. Be gone. The powers will not relent. Hopefully Geralt's equipped with the skills required to kill this thing, because it sounds quite like ghostly, like a spirit, like the way it's talking, like 
the Echo. I'm a bit concerned on what we're going to be looking at in here. So find out what's killing villagers from down below. Explore the cave is the other... Yeah. So there is something, a threat over there. That is the um, the quest. The red flashing thing when we look through the witch's senses. Doesn't seem to be a way to go directly to it, so we may need to go in the water. Right, what have we got? Let's just keep swimming until we find the safest point. So nothing to loot down here. Actually, there's stuff to loot down here. There's um, anything useful. Oh, we got some good stuff. We've got a formula there. Actually, we're sorting else over here. Quickly, can we make it? Is that a plant or is it a box? I don't want to die. Just pick it up, whatever it is. It was some kind of uh, materials. Can we get to the surface here? Oh, yeah, we can. All right, it's no bother. So there was something else we didn't loot here. There's two boxes. Let's just get all the stuff. You know, because it's all stuff that we'll need some point in the game. All the recipes to make better potions, etc. Alright. Here we go. Why have you come? Why fill this blood? Are you here to grant me death? Or is my freedom your wish? Uh, what is that? Like, they look like proper infested testicles with spikes on them. I claim I can free you. No, so you claim I can free you. You claim to be imprisoned. How so? I am bound here in fetters of magic. I have wandered endlessly. A labyrinth of thieves. They got the veins. Um, I'll help you. I don't believe you. Gotta think this over. So I guess that's the option if you want to leave and come back later on. And say no, we can say okay. Uh, the kids are, in, are clearly... The kids in clearing are in danger. Yeah, so explain. Why are they in danger? Why do you think the kids from the meadow are in danger? The sisters took them. They shall not return. Where'd they take them? I can help. It is done already. It cannot be undone. There are no rules to add ceremony. They shall all die. Let them be saved. I don't believe her. What it? The testicle spiky veiny balls. Because the voice as well, it doesn't sound very like like a savior. It sounds horrible. I'm going to say I don't believe you. I don't believe you, spirit. Too many claim you're evil. Your words alone, not enough. Dead me. And against you will rise. All the powers of nature. Alright. If that's what you want to do. You started it. Uh. Do I have to attack the actual thing as well, or just keep killing these until it opens up? Not too sure how this is going to work. I can't attack it. So there must be waves of enemies you have to kill first. And then we'll move on to this. Here we go. Holy shit. Did some good damage to that. I think we can just hack down the wood. Keep going for it. We got it. So it was ever. All right. So everyone was con was claiming that it was evil. Um. So I did what people asked me to do, which was kill it. I really. I, I got a feeling if I would have let that live and do its thing, it would have come back and just like destroyed the children or something, you know, done something really bad. You know, because if everyone's saying it's evil, and it even talks of an evil voice, I'm going to say that's evil. I'm not going to believe the um, the talk it has. No way. 
So I'm, I'm pretty happy with the choice I did there and how it ended up. So we need to go tell the Elderman, Elderman now that we've done what he asked of us. I'm sure he's going to be really pleased. Because I think that was a big problem for the people in that village for a while. And he's going to be like, oh, you're amazing. Have all my money. What is that? A werewolf? Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the Whispering Hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? Yeah, a big spiky testicle ball, veiny monster. A spirit has possessed a tree. Destroyed something, not sure what. <laughs> you don't want to know. Um, that one. Not sure what was lurking there, but it lurks no more. What did you do, Witcher? I stabbed it over and over again. Some being had come to possess the tree's heart. I destroyed the heart and its inhabitant. So it were a ghost? Will it be back? No. He seems disappointed. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Aye, oh, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. What's you got to do with the dagger? Sacrifice something. Is he gonna take his own blood or something? What's he gotta do? Oh! <laughs> you actually seen a bit of it cut off. That was gruesome. <laughs> oh, it's all yellow. There's payment. Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? Oh. It is our pact. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So, all those ears in the woods. Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive must seek his own protectors. I can't believe the way he did that then. I mean, obviously he had to use, he had to use the knife because that's why the witches give it to him. But... Um, he could have done it in a bit of a cleaner way. You know, got some alcohol, you know, some, some wipes, some, some um, cloth to bandage it up a little bit. And he just walked... Oh my god, that was disgusting. Dirty bastard. So we've got the ear. I'm going to put it on a rock. Oh, what's that? Oh my god! Sheave your weapon, young man! In real life, you're different. They're the witches! You were in the tapestry. Well, bring it here! Bring it here! Here! <laughs> here! <laughs> here. <laughs> Look at the size of the one in the middle. It's got a basket for a face. There's another ear to the collection. Ah. Never seek to cross us again. We shall forgive you this transgression, for you've done well. Your children are plump as piglets, sweet as caramel. But now we must talk to our white-haired friend. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. Oh. She belongs to no man. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seeds sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. 
Ahem. It is another woman who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. Oh my god. That's the Baron's wife? Oh, she's like proper... She's in hell. I thought it was just a crazy old lady, but it's his wife. She's, she's saving the witches. Oh my god. Um, tell me about the woman I seek. You used me. Why do you look different now? And also, I'm wondering if that tree was um, telling the truth about saving the children. Because they, that, that witch just mentioned about how the children tasty. I'm like, fuck, are they going to fuck the children up? Did I make the wrong choice again? So, um, I want to look more into this, like, deeper. About I want to talk to them about other stuff. You used me to tame the Whispering Hillock. A lot of work. Not free, brave soul. Did you destroy the evil powers? Have you brought peace to our domain? Yes. So fortunate to have found so brave a knight, so able. So, what do you want the kids for? Um, I want to. I want to ask both of these questions, but I'm hope if I have to choose, I want to ask about the kids. What did you need the children for? Need we? They needed us. Our care. Where are they? They are far away. Oh my God. Their troubles are over. I feel really bad now. Tell me about the woman I seek. Our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Finn was a rail, terrified, exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. Um, where is she now? Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word. So tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, brave boy. Alright, so we're going to be playing as Siri again, I guess. Seeing her side of the story. We knew someone special at the line. We read beast and tales, saw the omens. We would glimpse her likeness, a mirage in a battle. She came from the lower swamp. We knew not at first it was her the omens had spoken of. A child of the elder blood. The soul seed that would burst into flame. Oh my god. So were they were they always out of the picture? She fell into our hands. The blood! Mm, the blood of the traitress. Does she sleep? Like a lamb. Come, sisters, no point in dawdling. The table set. The cauldron bubbles. We cannot. You know she is meant for him. Imlareth will get her. He will, but not whole. <laughs> well said. We'll just have a sample. I'll take her feet. Lovely. I'm plump. Perfect for a broth. Oh, I can taste it already. Very well. Get on with it. Is this before the Baron? The vi she visited the Baron or after? Because you don't know how I ended up with the Baron. You'll regret that girl. Regret it dearly. Oh, she just escaped. Oh my god, the black one was there. 
So I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that maybe this was before she ran into the Baron. Because when they started showing the Baron bit, Baron bit she was kind of running away. Okay, we're playing as her. Whoa. Oh my god. Escape the crook bog. Crook back bog. Can we just um, run away from this? Because there's, there's loads of enemies. So just run. It looks like she's got infinite stamina, so she can spin forever. Just keep running. Because those witches look like they just summoned all those monsters, didn't they? Have we made it? God, he's right there. He's literally like a stone throw away. Some cool armor on the horse, though. Hollow bones and stuff. Like, looks like Skyrim dragon dragon bone armor. All right then. He lost her so easily. I mean, if they can trace her all the way here, how can he lose her when he's so close? She was only in a tree. <laughs> I thought they had like this second, this like sixth sense where they could find whatever they're looking for, but no. Sometime later, she's always running through the woods, isn't she? I think this is where the, she ran to the Baron. Yeah, that's the bit where she fell and um, done the bit with the werewolf and the girl, and then she went to the Baron shortly after that. I think. Yeah. Butcher her like an animal and eat her. Her blood, the taste brought back the memories of our youth. Elder blood, extraordinary girl, but you know that. Such a shame she fled. I won't let you get away with it. I'll find her and come back for you. They're both the same, really, aren't they? I'm gonna go for the top one because that one seems more immediate. You know, I'm, I won't let you get away with it now. I'm like, I'm gonna fuck you up. <laughs> you tried to kill her. Can't forgive you for that. Waste of words. Is this gonna be a fight? Our fates are bound true, but now is not the time for that to bear fruit. Now you shall chase shadows and wander midst fog. Each time you see her, she will be a mirage. What's going on? And if you find her, if the girl <laughs> will die, <laughs> the same handsome knight. <laughs> oh my god, they actually really scare me. What was she doing with those legs? They were like legs hanging off her hip and she was like spreading them in a sexual way. So we got the quest for the and the Baron has been updated now. We can now tell the Baron that his wife has been saving the witches. Which is messed up. Alright guys, that's all we've got time for for this video. In the next video we'll head straight over to the, um, the Baron and tell him about his wife and that she is saving the witches and then um, the Baron in return will tell us about Siri and what how she ended up with him. So um, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video.